All right, here he is, the number one lightweight contender, making his way to the octagon and looking to leave as the new undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. He has bided his time, waiting for this title shot. He's got the winning streak. He has the quality of opposition. Now he's fighting the number one guy in the world. He believes he's the best. Now his opportunity to prove it just a few minutes away. All right, here he is, the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. Of course, the target is on his back. All eyes are on this man tonight as he tries to make good on yet another title defense. He has owned this division for some time. The question is, as the challenges get stiffer, can he remain the hunted? Several championship fights to his credit, a lot of 25-minute wars. As he gets older, the challenges get stiffer. We'll see how he handles this one tonight. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. Volkanovski is two years the elder. He will have a one-inch reach advantage. How about some Bruce Buffer? Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. It's time! Five rounds for the UFC Lightweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 25 wins, two losses. He stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Presenting the challenger, Alexander the Great Volkanovski. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a wrestler, holding a professional record of 24 wins, one loss. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting at a Mecca Russia, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. Sure if that's the way he drew it up, but 
a huge result for him here tonight as he gets the win by way of knockout. And that's about as good a one-strike finish as we've seen here in the UFC in recent memory. I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So a big, big win for him here tonight. All right, DC, no Telestrator tonight, but we're going to get you some highlights from this one. This was a fight that had it all, and for my money, his best performance to date. His best performance to date in the biggest moment. In the biggest moments, you got to show up, and that's exactly what he did tonight. He used every bit of his skill to get the job done. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's going to stop to this contest at two minutes, 11 seconds in the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and new UFC lightweight champion of the world, Alexander the Great Monogoski. Well, tears of joy and hard to blame him. We have a new UFC lightweight champion. The celebration is on, and a life's mission comes to a head tonight as he gets it done. He knew he was going to get it done. He told us all he would get it done. I am the best fighter in the world. It is just a matter of time until I get the belt wrapped around my waist tonight. He got that done. Look at him celebrate with his corner. Those guys all believe, and he got the job done.